Hi, I joined the Republican Party yesterday, and boy, do you guys have a lot of fun. I <laughs> see where uh, Rupert Murdoch and the uh, Fox News has excluded uh, our candidate, Ron Paul, uh, from the New Hampshire uh, debates. Uh, <clears throat> Hmm. Well, is it is it not clear that Fox News has their own agenda? And it doesn't appear that their agenda is the same as Ron Paul's, and certainly is not the same as mine. They have, from day one, been supporting the war in Iraq. And if you didn't agree with the war in Iraq, you were unpatriotic. Well, you know, I'm like Ron Paul. I didn't support the war. Uh, of course, I wasn't a representative or any, anybody in the official. But just at work, I, I said, no, this is a mistake. You know, you, you can't do this. Um, you know, it's not worth it. It's not worth it in our loss of prestige. It's not worth it uh, in the lives we're going to lose. And it's not worth it in, in just monetary costs. You know, it's a mistake. I had served in, in Vietnam as a young lieutenant on the ground. I know what war is like. And it's just, you know, it, it amazes me that in the same generation, we could make the same mistake twice. Vietnam and Iraq. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I just, you know, well, it's just unbelievable. Um, so their agenda is, is, is much different. Uh, you know, and you can't, you can't argue with them, uh, uh, you know, and obviously they're ruled from the top down, they all are saying the same thing. So, but I guess, in all probability, uh, Mr. Paul won't be able to uh, participate in the debates. Uh, that's bad, but, you know, it's, this is a long war we're in. And uh, well, we'll overcome this, and I, I, I think in the end it's going to be to to Mr. Paul's benefit. Uh, it very well might be that he will gain by not being uh, in the debate. You know, who knows? Uh, I have a suggestion uh, that we we as the unofficial campaign for. Ron Paul that we can do. Uh, the first is easy. Send him some money. I was going to send him money on December 31st, but I went ahead and sent him some today. And uh, I'm going to send him some more on December 31st. So I don't think they really need it. But if everybody would send money now and uh, send all you got now, and then send some more on December 31st. Uh, there's no telling how much money that will be. And it'll do two things. It'll send a statement, you know, to the rest of the country. And it, it'll help uh, the official Ron Paul campaign combat uh, uh, Fox News. I don't know exactly uh, what they could do. Uh, but I, I have all the confidence in the world that they can uh, make this event uh, turn out to be advantageous to the, to the campaign. So, first recommendation, send some money. I've watched a lot of these videos, and I understand the anger. When I, when I first heard it, I just you know, got up from the computer and started you know, shouting at the wall, you know, you know what do you bastards think y'all are doing and all you know, and all and all and all. Well, I got over that, but I see a lot of anger. Uh, you'll get over it. It's a long, long war. It's who can outlast who. And so knowing that, we've just got to calm down and we've got to, we've got to respond. So let's respond with money, number one. And the second thing you can do and I can't do it because I don't have the expertise. I can't even, you know, I, I don't even know how to ma ma make a website or a web page. Um, I, it's a miracle that I can get these videos up. Um, the thing that you can do, uh, from my experience, 
is, is it comes from the civil rights movement uh, from Martin Luther King, and I think he got it from Gandhi. And you know, civil disobedience, it's boycotting, and this is totally civil. You know, there's no, there's no anger. There's, you know, there's no throwing stuff. You need to find out. Somebody needs to find out. Somebody needs to publish a website uh, and list all the advertisers for Fox News and Fox. You know, I guess in general, uh, as Fox Sports. I think that's where they make most of their money. That's the only reason I watch Fox is the sports. Uh, you know, list them and, and uh, list, uh, you know, their telephone number, their email address, and, and their mailing address so that people like me can go there and get it and we can all go there and get it and, and, and contact these people and tell them you know, that we're not going to buy their products until they disassociate themselves uh, from Fox. And I mean, I'll do it. I don't care if it's Coca-Cola. I don't know, you know, I don't know what they advertise, but I'll, I'll quit drinking Cokes. That's a big thing for me. Uh, so on that website, you know, list, you know, list advertisers, how to contact them, and you, and you Somebody might be creative enough to be able to put little snippets that we can cut and paste and email those out. It'd just be millions and billions of them, maybe. Uh, if, it, if it were successful, as successful as the money bombs, uh, it, would, uh, it, it would hurt uh, Fox. You know, ultimately, Fox has got to look at their bottom line. You know, you know, if they can't make money, they're not going to stay in business. So, if it, and if it were successful, it would be, uh, it might be the biggest boycott in, in U.S. history. And America has a history of boycotts, and uh, a lot of them have been successful, especially in the civil rights area. And, uh, <laughs> oh, and, you know, and not to be so glum, I am a, uh, a junkie, a Ron Paul junkie, and uh, I watched a video, I think it was yesterday or today, uh, from this young girl, and her, the title on her video is uh, Ron Paul Junkie. If, if you have a chance, you ought to, you ought to search that and, and, and look at it, and uh, I just thought, well, golly, look at this young girl. You know, she's so pretty, she's so intelligent, she's so cool, you know, really neat. And then I, I found out later that uh, uh, Ron Paul uh, has hired her, uh, not to work in the campaign, but to work in his office in Washington. And I, you know, I said, well, God, well, you know, that's pretty cool. That, you know, that, uh, you know it, it looks good for the girl, but really what impressed me was... Um, that Ron Paul would do that, and you ought to read and see why you know he does it that way, and it's really it's really refreshing to me, and and you know it just makes me feel good that he's going to hire people like that rather than uh, uh, what you would normally see up in Washington. It'd probably be a big big change in Washington if he were like that. You know? So. Uh, that's about it. Uh, <laughs> I don't script these things out, and I can't edit. I don't know how to edit yet. Uh, and I, I feel so inadequate when I see all these, God, you know, just look like they came out of, a, you know, a movie production to see these videos. But at any rate, that's, that's what I've got. And um, uh, in summary, uh, send him some money. And somebody think about a boycott of the advertisers on Fox. Okay, peace out. <laughs>